What's up? We have our honey lattes with oat milk. milk. With oat yes. milk. Yes. Okay, let's try them. Oh, I like it's it. It's good. Yeah. You can, oh, this place is really good. Wow. It's light, but it's good. Yeah, this is like, it's not too sweet, but it's also not too strong, which I like. Mm hmm. You're gonna be like, do you guys think you're coffee experts or something? <laughs> Coffee talk! <laughs> how, literally how we ordered, which one's sweeter? <laughs> we couldn't even find the menu. <laughs> I was like staring at a distance like just fucking, I like spaced out. I thought you would like, you would know what you wanted already. I didn't remember. So I would just be like, oh, I'll just get that. <laughs> I'm happy with this. This is good. Yeah, I want to try the vanilla. Mm -hmm. But honey is sweeter, so. Yeah. I taste the I don't usually like honey flavored things, but mm -hmm. this is good. Shoot. But would you rate this? I would rate this, I don't know, like on what type of scale? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> compared to Starbucks, it's like a 10. Yeah. <laughs> well, compared to like my liking of Phil's. Oh yeah, It's Phil's. different. Phil's is just, Phil's I know is like, like brewed coffee, but this is espresso shots. Oh, I didn't even know that. Mm -hmm. I just drink whatever. We'll see you when we're at Goodwill. <laughs> What's up guys? We are going to <laughs> I caught me off guard. <laughs> like Okay, well we're going to a <laughs> tattoo or piercing shop. I'm like that the awkward sibling that your parents <laughs> want you to bring. We're going to hot ink. There's another one right here too. Whatever's cheaper and not <laughs> gonna get me infected. That's True. cash only. No change. You have to have perfect amount of coins. <laughs> what if it's like 69 cents? I'm going to get my septum pierced today. I don't know what I'm gonna get done yet. We're we'll gonna walk see. in and just decide whatever screams. Oh Where are we? We're in, um, this is downtown. Yeah, it's not popping at all. I think a lot of the places are abandoned. Yeah, it looks like it. But yeah, this place is called Hot Ink. Hot Ink Tattoos. <laughs> we don't say like that. Hot Ink Tattoos. Hot Ink. <laughs> we don't have an appointment. We're just gonna walk in. Yeah, we're gonna try our luck and see if we can get something in. Realistically though, how many people actually know that's not even true. I was gonna say how many people are going to get pierced, to get pierced or get tattoos, but that's actually a lot of people. Like right especially now. during quarantine. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody's trying to stay the same. Everyone's gone through at least like two mental breakdowns <laughs> and just like needed just like a change. We're yes, going right the there where it says tattoo. That's so convincing. <laughs> There's not a lot of people in downtown. There's an empty couch. <laughs> For leisure. <laughs> ah, okay, see you guys inside. She's just gonna be my roommate. I know, roomie's at heart. <laughs> nice lashes. Thank you. Check your septum to make sure you have enough room between your cartilage and the bottom of your pierceable tissue. Right. It's hard to get in there. I'm so scared. <laughs> Don't be. It's fine. You know, looking at your nose, you can probably go with a little bit smaller piece of jewelry if you want to. So you don't want it to like protrude out hella, yeah. right? You just want like those dots if anything. Mm -hmm. It was more painful every time because you'd have to pierce over scar tissue. Yeah. You should just rock it, you know, because you want it to heal. Mm -hmm. If you keep messing with it, like touching it all the time, it's going to take forever to heal. Okay. Okay. Until there's no makeup on my nose now. <laughs> no. Are you ready for this? I think so. I think so. My cons hurt more. I get it like mixed things about the. Some people are like, wow, that was nothing.
two, go ahead. You got it? No, I'm good, I'm good. Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm just gonna give you a quick little break. Go ahead and, <laughs> go ahead and wipe your eyes. There you go. And now, squeeze the ball out. You got through the, the worst part, though. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> How you feel? Good. Yeah. <laughs> it's on. It looks really good. This bitch didn't do anything, but it's okay. It was a long way. Yeah, it was. But it looks cute. Yay, I like it. I'm glad I like it. We got three star. It was so good. <laughs> good. You like it? Mm -hmm. Rate it out of 10. Like nine. Good. Because I'm reserving 10 out of 10 food. <laughs> Look, my septum. Oh my god, my pimple's so big. My septum's cute. Okay, <laughs> today we went thrifting. We went to Goodwill and Eco Thrift. Eco Thrift. So we're going to show you what we got. I got some good stuff. I didn't get much stuff, but I got good stuff. So, I got this first. This is just... I don't know, what does it say? Keep them wild. Keep them wild. Spirit of the environment. Spirit of the environment. <laughs> and I support that message because I think the zoos should not exist. Facts. But I think I'm going to cut this into a crop top because I just like the, what is that, a lion? A panther? Tiger. I don't really know. That's all, not a tiger. All three like, of them are the same to me. A cat. I'm not going to keep that long, so I'm going to crop that and I think it'll be cute. No. This is good for no, this is Goodwill. <laughs> this is from Goodwill. It is, <sighs> bless you, it's a, that brand, whatever that says. And I don't know what I'm going to do with it yet, but we're going to find something. It's cute. I really like that. That shirt that I just showed you was $1.98. This one was like $6 and something cents. This one is just not in season right now, but <laughs> it's cute. It's a grandpa sweater, and I like to wear these in the winter because I don't really like to try because I want to be comfy but also cute. This is a dollar and That's ninety a good price. eight cents, and I'm probably gonna share this with my boyfriend, honestly. <laughs> oh sh! These are from Uniqlo. This is corduroy pants. I'm gonna keep them open like that, but I'm going to obviously. So this is the last thing that I got. It's just this yep. corduroy sherpa jacket. Um, it was six bucks. That'll be nice in the winter. I got all winter clothes even though oh, we're about to true. approach Summer. July, which is like the hottest month. <laughs> it's a size large and kid, but I'm tiny so it'll fit. I got this from Eco Thrift. I got these jeans. They were $1.98. I'm gonna have to fix those too eventually. My fave! I got these. They're shorts. They're Columbia brand. Yes, the Columbia authentic issue. This was Four ninety eight from Goodwill. I went in San Jose, so I got this How like cute. cardigan thing. It's green, olive, it's Poshmark. And then I found this top. This one was five fifty nine, and you can un wow. you can undo this. She's thing. ready for the summer. Yeah, ready to go back to Hawaii, <laughs> or she just goes cropped like that. I like that. That's cute. Thanks. Pero ya. Thanks for watching our haul. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Hi guys. Okay, so I wanted to talk about my experience getting my septum pierced. So when I first saw the the piercing, like sitting on the table, I was like, that is hella big. And then he was like, no, that's normally the size that we usually do. And I was like, okay, well, all right. And then he was like, hold on a second. I think you might be able to fit the smaller one. I ended up getting the smaller one. I think it fits my nose perfectly because it doesn't look like overpowering. Like growing up, I hated septums, not gonna lie. Like I used to think septums were like low key ugly because I just looked like a bull to me. Within these past few years, I've learned to love septums and I just really like, like how they look. I like it. I think it suits my face. It doesn't seem like it's overpowering because it's too big, but no, I feel like it's like the perfect size for my nose. And the reason why I really wanted a septum was because I know I can flip it and tuck it in. And I did tell the piercer that, I don't know why, but he told me not to do that because it can cause infections and it will take longer to heal because it's just constantly moving. So I don't think I'm going to flip it like very often. 
unless I really have to or I just don't feel like I want to wear it. If I do a hoop here, I'm going to have a stud here. If I have a hoop here, I'm going to tuck this in. I just really have to play with different looks that I can do with this if you want to call it a look. But for me, I feel like my pain tolerance is pretty high. I was able to get this tattoo and a tattoo behind my ear. It was manageable, is doable. As for my conch, I have two, two inside of my ear and that hurt so bad. I don't know why. It was just like an overwhelming pain. I was able to sit through it, but I don't think I would do it again. As for my septum, that hurt really bad. I don't think it hurt as bad as this. This definitely, definitely had a long lasting pain after as for this, it just felt sore like any other piercing one. So out of 10, I would rate this maybe like a 7 on the pain scale. I think I look cute and girly, but like I have a little edge to me, you know? So, and I don't know. Do I suit this? Is this a look for me? Let me know. Comment down below. Well, regardless of what you say, I'm going to keep it because I like it. I paid 67 with tax and everything that was with the jewelry thank you guys so much for watching this video of me and pia go thrifting and getting my septum pierced i had i guess you could say a lot of fun i had a lot of fun with hanging with her this wasn't that fun but it was i'm liking the finished result make sure to like comment and subscribe and make sure to follow all my social media which will be down below see you guys next time bye I'm currently eating an ice cream and every time I bite, my septum gets ice cream on it.